Now, before anything, I just wanna say that I'm not an expert on drugs, all right? Matter of fact, I don't do drugs. However, there was a time where I actually took Percocet. And that is obviously what I'm gonna be talking about in today's video. Now, if you didn't know, back in 2019, I went to the hospital because I had mono. I actually made a video on what having mono felt like, which you could obviously check it out right here. Anyways, the thing is that I was having mono and I was feeling lots, lots of fucking pain. I was feeling so much pain that they gave me morphine and they also gave me Percocet. So obviously, I took Percocet on the hospital. So the scenario was like this. I was in the hospital, right? I was, I was having mono, I was feeling lots of pain and I was feeling so much pain that the nurses gave me morphine. I actually made a video on what morphine felt like if you want to check it out right here the thing is that morphine obviously felt good and that shit actually made me lose the pain however in my mind I was like damn like I can get addicted to this shit so I asked the nurse could you give me something not as strong as morphine but something a little bit harder than ibuprofen and that's when the nurse told me actually we could give you Percocet now, when she told me she could give me Percocet, the first thing that came to my mind was the rappers. You know, those rappers that presume drugs, Molly Percocet, Molly Percocet, you know? And that came to my mind, I was like, damn, I'm gonna be taking one of those fucking drugs. When she gave it to me, it was actually in a pill. Like, she gave me a pill and I took it. 20 minutes later, I was feeling happier and I was feeling relaxed. I remember that when I had mono, I was feeling very depressed and that actually took me out of my depression and it made me become more positive. I remember my brother's wife was also in the hospital in the room with me and I remember she brought me food and she was like taking care of me and I remember that she made me feel very optimistic and I remember becoming more sensitive. I remember telling my brother's wife, hey, thank you so much for being here with me you know thank you so much for like actually buying me food and for being here in the hospital with me because she was the only one that was with me in the hospital at least at that time i remember i was openly telling her thank you so much for helping me during these hard times you know and i don't usually do that i'm usually the type of person to just keep it to myself sometimes sometimes at least when it comes to stuff like that you know it's kind of weird i don't know now of course after the effects everything went back to normal and what was my normal at that moment? Everything I was feeling was fucking pain. And I felt pain again. So it was definitely temporary. But in the moment, obviously, it felt nice. However, many in fact do abuse the substance even when they're not feeling pain. They just take it because they just wanna feel good. And obviously, you should not fucking do that. However, that is how people do become addicted to that type of shit because they just take it without actually needing it. I would say, in my opinion, the only time you do need Percocet is if you're feeling physical pain. If you're feeling emotional pain or mental pain, you don't need the fucking drug. Trust me, your brain is powerful enough to heal by itself. Don't be a pussy, all right? Other than that, thank you guys so much for watching. Of course, if you like this video, please like, comment, subscribe, and share, of course. Click that bell icon, because if you do not click that bell icon, mine as well, you're just not even subscribed. Follow me on Instagram at alvarox 9 of course, and DM me. DM me about this video, you know, DM me about anything because honestly, I fucking love it when people DM me and tell me I came from your YouTube channel because that actually motivates me fucking a lot. And I do follow back, just letting you know. Other than that, thank you guys so much for watching. Comment, like, subscribe, share. alvarox 9 baby. Boop, boop, boop.